Nigerian Defense Headquarters has reacted to videos on social media showing the presence of United Nations fighting vehicles and equipment in Benin Edo State. A statement on Tuesday by Acting Director of Defense Information Brigadier General Toko Gusa said the fighting has caused insinuations and panic. He however clarified that Nigeria is contributing troops to United Nations peacekeeping. The most recent being United Nations Interim Security Force for Abi Munisfa in Southern Sudan, Gusa, clarified. The spokesperson noted that the mission is commanded by Nigerian Major General Benjamin Olufemi uh, Sawyer, saying the United Nations doesn't have its own troops. The world body, he explained, usually enters into an agreement with countries to provide their personnel and equipment for operations in its various missions. The vehicles and equipment painted in United Nations color are being moved through the war report for movement to the mission area in southern Sudan to join our troops inducted into UNISFA last month, Gusau said. The defense headquarters assured Nigerians that the country is not under any threat that will warrant deployment of United Nations troops into her soil. My viewers, at all was your reaction to this. Uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section and your voice be heard and clear around the world as a uh, United uh, uh, as a uh, defense headquarters addresses, uh, you know, uh, military uh, vehicles and equipment cited uh, in a uh, 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 state, uh, Benin precisely. Okay, was your reaction to this? Uh, uh, please uh, drop your reaction in the comment section and your voice be heard and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel. Uh, for more update from uh, Daily Express, uh, thanks and God bless. We are here to do justice to your reactions. Uh, stay tuned as we look into the reaction uh, sections. Okay. Joseph Okun says, uh, You are joking by saying Nigeria is not under threat. United Nations labor Nigeria terrorist country. February presidential election rigged by P APC government and you are saying not under threat. That is according to uh, Joseph Okun. Still uh, taking more reactions. Uh, Anthony uh, to Joseph Okun says, uh, my brother, uh, my brother, you reply him well. My brother, you reply him well. Then uh, David to uh, Joseph Okun says, uh, don't mind bro. Don't mind, bro. Zodak says uh, if uh, uh, Zodak says it, it appoints troops from its terrorist country into its peacekeeping force and appoints its general to head the force. Then the UN is a terrorist organization. Okay. Then plus two three to Kohn also says uh, I beg help me tell them which kind thread past this one. Okay. More reactions here, uh, plus two again, says, uh, I'm sure that was what you were waiting to hear, but unfortunately, we are disappointed. United Nations does not have troops of their own. Get that into your school and reason well. Then plus three again, says, uh, Joseph, my brother, thanks for your wise reply. You said our mind. Peter Obi and Dafty the Goat uh, says, um, Tokon says, uh, You are sick upstairs. You are delusional like your El Fulefu, Peter Obi, the failure. Claiming mandate when he never won election. Okay. Then uh, Ekene Kenneth here also commented saying, uh, Igbo man has been the military spokesperson all this while. 
Why did they allow this man to speak now? Yet I don't even understand what he is saying. So, worry swap port only operate for UN military arms, but not for other uses. Something fishy is going on here. Then, uh, Terila uh, Tokon says, uh, I love this. Gaba Adulugba says, uh, why can't you come out and demo and show your threat then? You know if Nigeria is a sovereign country, that not even a country can threaten her. Do any her and you receive Wutu Wutu. That obedient himself cannot save you. Okay. We are still here taking more reactions. Uh, stay tuned, please, as we take more uh, reactions. Okay. And uh, also, to Anthony Agunu says, uh, South Sudan and Wari are not on the same line. South Sudan is not of Nigeria and there's no river or ocean to South Sudan. How do you explain this that they are going to South Sudan through war reports? Okay. Leo Keshuku to Anthony Agunu says he uh, is talking to goats. Okay. Uh, Lihe laughing there. Uh, laughing. Plus 2384817 uh, here uh, to Anthony says uh, fear of the unknown. Fear of the unknown. Right, to so still here taking more reactions, uh, stay tuned, please. Then Davidson, Davidson ran, uh, also commented here saying, uh, When the writing, okay, we say when the writing is not done, this is what you will always come up Nigeria force should stop defending the corrupt politicians that want to destroy the country because of power. If the elections is free and fair, we won't see all these things. God bless Nigeria and unite us more, stronger. Okay? And uh, also, too, there's a reply from guests to Davis Iran saying that Nigeria has been at war for a long time. If you say Nigeria is not at war, go out to buy something, that same thing you buy today will double its price the following day. Okay, then a uh, plus story here to Davis Iran say, says, uh, how do you know the election is not free and fair? Do you personally have proof of what you are alleging? For your information, there is nothing that is not free and fair in that election. The ringing concept has always been the regular songs of election losers. There has not been any election in this uh, country that any loser has not claimed to be ringed. Okay, and this is all can take for now. Uh, thanks and God bless. Ensure you subscribe to our channel, spread the report across on these platforms, and buy for now, please. And stay tuned for more reports. Do join us in the other news, please. Okay, thanks so much for listening. Okay, buy for now, please.